Are we ready for this? Are we really ready for this? <clears throat> As we know, the ash is falling. The world's gone mad. Oh, that's a bit loud. Here. Hang on. There we go. Now we can go to Ding Dong Dell and meet Horus, apparently. Not saying information about it, but <clears throat> that's not to do side quests now. Let's just go five. Go back to where horrors began. Hi, horse. Welcome back to the beginning. <clears throat> Where are you? Where it all started between me and him. Ali, you're here at last. I've been waiting. Come on, man. <clears throat> See the monument? Yeah. For the record, it says, a first and second spell makes black stroke. That will serve you well to make another. <clears throat> if you combine the first two spells, you will get unleashed. Unleash. Answer. I don't really under. Can you combine spells in? Well done, I'm very. <clears throat> Form familiar and gateway. Make the super duper one. Oh. Never forget the basics. And solving it is proof that you've already learned another super duper spell! Thunderstorm! Where's. <laughs> Alright, enough of the. I remembered the ash. What do you know about the white ash? Ash, the mana, it turned all the people. <clears throat> Oh no. Time ago. That's all. But that's all I remember. 
Mm -hmm. That the big stone here was a monument to the stage of it. I came here, it might help me to remember. But I don't think this is where I died. There's something else I need to remember, something more important. I'm going to carry on traveling. I need to f If I can find it, I might remember everything. Oh man. Well, that just put me in a mood. It would have been better if it was like he died from some great fight. And it's like, okay, you died a warrior, a hero. But instead, it's like, the ash killed you. Like, something unknown and like, something you didn't expect. To ever hurt, hit him. anything kind of sad <clears throat> hey um once again we're at the scary point of the game again luckily we don't have to fight anything to get for data <laughs> Flippin' act, that big beast looks cow in familiar. Oh no! Oh. For two? oh no! Inhumane doctor. Oh jeez! <clears throat> I like this Radiant Sword, though. Ow. We are perfectly fine, don't worry. Ow. If I have to change, change the other. Let's see your horses. Can it work? Ah, oh, come on! Don't unleash the darkness.
Uh oh. That's not good. I've missed. That's not cool. Fight first. Quicker. I like this Evan Tide though. I mean the Evan Star. <clears throat> That's gonna be helpful against light types. It's not. I'm sorry. It's funny no matter how many times we hear it. Hmm? Short one, how confusing. A dream about some manner of terrifying bull. You're not amused. You are a moo. I uh, want to. <clears throat> You justice, you are a vision. Oh, yeah, she had that picture of him. I mean, that's creepy. We should get back to the iron wyvern. Yes. <laughs> Proper.
from the pages of the Look, it's here. What the flip did you? Apus. At least I have you to talk to. <gasps> what the council are doing? Can it be right? Earlier on, I overheard the captain of the guards. He said the kingdom was in a parlous state. He spoke of people too poor to buy bread and of the starving dying in the streets. Yet, the council assure me all is well. Council's lying. Who is telling the truth? Tell me, Apis. This is most troubling. The Queen persists in her wish to involve herself in the affairs of state. We Should this continue, she may realize that it is we who now rule the kingdom and alert the populace. <laughs> Surely it would do little harm to allow her to sit on the council. Provided that we keep the more sensitive matters from Her Majesty's hearing. Yes, and ensure that she is made publicly responsible for all of the Council's decisions. Ha! A most splendid idea. We shall keep our kingdom while she takes all the blame. <laughs> <laughs> I knew as much. I figured that's the run it would. Father, that's the run. I know you will be proud of me. Today, the council gave me their approval. I am to be involved in the affairs of state. Now I can work for the best interests of my subjects. I have taken a long, hard look at myself. And I have decided to put my subjects first, and do all I can to rid the world of war and famine. Father, I have learned of the existence of an ancient spell with the power to end all suffering. I shall do you proud. I vow that I will master that spell, and save my subjects and kingdom from despair. Soon, Father. Soon, I shall bring the light of hope into the lives of my people. <clears> Hold <throat> up, man. So, it wasn't her? This somewhere. I wonder where it could be. I'm not a fan of that Council of Twelve bunch. I trust them about as far as I can kick them. Hard. It's the oldest story, though, ever, when it comes to kingdoms. Whenever there's, like, a very young heir, like a child, that's supposed to take the throne after their family, like, after the parents are gone, there's always that so-called council, or chancellor, or advisor that 
steps in and is like, oh, we'll take care of everything since you're too young. Ordeal. And thus... And thus, they screw everything else up. Everything up. And you're the one that gets... You're the one that's blamed for it all. Because you didn't do anything about it. Which is worse because you didn't even know what was going on until the very end. And then you have to scramble to try and put it all back together. <laughs> and sometimes it's too late to do that. <clears throat> so you know what you do? You kill the get you kill the advisor or the counselor or the so or whoever. The story's actually been done in Aladdin. Like mm. Like stories like Aladdin had that scenario where the advisor Jafar wants to control control um the kingdom and uses Jasmine and tries to get her hands on the um the lamp to make her love him and such. Nito! The problem is there's always stories like that. There's always that one person that tends to ruin it all. <laughs> there's always that little wrench that gets thrown in their plans. In that case, it would be Aladdin. <clears throat> Ah. Fancy your chances, do you? Okay. No slacking you lot. Oh, oh drop kick. Street bodyguard? Oh, excuse me? Who the heck 
could be here, though. What I want to know is, who would be in control of this place? Look! There it is! There it is! So we're back here again. Stop yep. your whinging, man. I mean, it could be worse. Huh? <clears throat> oh. Oh. What the? Tank. That's the very latest weapon in Hamlin's arsenal. You're telling me machines are turning into monsters now? I cannot say. Whoa. The way it's acting, yeah. Wow. That explains what's here now. Here, let's try this. Whoa, that was fast. Could use some work. Far but it's just to see. It was nice to actually use his magic now. Prism God. Nice. Nice. happening. What the? Okay. Oh man, that wild mine! Oh. After it's big dramatic fall, the guy's like, he could wipe your entire party out with that attack. It's like Boy, this guy, this spell cast is fast. The animation's a little long, but that's okay. Magic. Right. Right. Sanctify. Sanctify. Let's 
means it's time for the prince to turn to his people. Your Majesty, the city is in ruins. They were you. I'm your symbols. Everyone calm down. I said calm down. But our chief concern... Okay. Emperor for a moment. Wow, man. In any case, Hogar, the fine leader, he can be relied upon. We're trusting you, Rhino. Let's get back to the Iron Iron, shall we? Okay. Oh yeah, we get to do another memory. This will be interesting. Hey. 
Mm, it's all thanks to P. Yeah, we're no closer to knowing who it was that sent the mana. Actually, I did you anything. <clears throat> Too right, we need to find whoever is behind all this and get them. Look, another flower! Suddenly. It has. When we were in your world, she told you that the ash falling was her fault. I don't know. The effects. This entire mystery. Got the key. <clears throat> It'll be a pleasant one, no matter. We must see the truth with our own eyes. Okay. Yeah, show us everything. <clears throat> How? How could this happen? Every man, woman, and child in my kingdom. How? Why did this happen? Mana was meant to help them. Not... not... this. Tell me why. My name is Cassiopeia. I am queen of Nazcar. When I was a child, I was known as P. I lived together with my father and did not want for anything. Then, when my beloved father passed away, I ascended the throne, little knowing what horrors awaited me. Ignorant of the affairs of state, I allowed the Council of Twelve to control everything. But the Council paid not the slightest heed to the well-being of my subjects. I had always thought of Nazcar as a peaceful realm, but now I saw that it was blighted by greed and torn apart by conflict. The scales had fallen from my eyes. I felt the desperation of those ground down by poverty. I felt the pain of those fighting for survival. And I saw how I had lived a gilded life of luxury. A life they could never hope to enjoy. I decided that I must change. I would work for the good of others and do all I could to eliminate conflict. That is how I arrived at my decision. That is what drew me to the spell that would save the world. Mana. When I came to use that spell, not a doubt clouded my mind. I was yes. certain that the mana would purify the hearts of my people. But it didn't. You were but tricked. Then, my dream of peace turned into a nightmare. All those whom the mana touched became beasts and turned upon each other. For years, the nightmare went on. The years stretched to decades. And still it continued. Then one day, I realized there was no one left. The council was gone. The guards were gone. My ladies in waiting, too. They were all gone. The manor I had unleashed had claimed the lives of every one of them. I am completely and utterly alone. But death is a privilege I shall never know. And who can say what this endless solitude may make of me? That is why 
I have decided to fill these flowers with my memories. If you have found this flower, I pray that you will find your way to me. That is my only wish. Until then, I shall be waiting, always waiting, alone in Nazcar. Wow. Mm. The manner of which she spoke. It's the same thing we've been dealing with here. She said she would be waiting to at a place called NASCAR. Smelly old NASCAR. A cause. The Fable Kingdom of Nazca was the seat of an advanced civilization of here uh, years ago. If we can find the site of the ancient compares, we can solve the mystery of the manor at last. Yes, we have to stop her. Let's go find the Kingdom of Nazca. Flower of Hope. Alright. Ride the dragon, where are we going? Oh, we have to talk to her, no one. Let's ride on Tinny! Tinny. Oh, where now? Like Doodle Doo! Him. Okay. Leave the iron. That doesn't look like a bird. I'm just saying. But we're not going there right now. We have to go he here. Guess what time it is. Wow. Gatekeeper has lost something important is Okay. No bounty hunts, okay.
So I got three. No, wait. Right? Three. Four. And what are these? Sixty-five, sixty-eight, six. Oh my god. Hang on. I gotta, um, go real quick. Just ten minutes. I gotta help, um, family with something. <laughs>